Our script is going to find this slider here that we drag in. So it's going to find this slider. This is unnecessary. In this video, I'm going to show you the simplest and best way to make health bars that I use in my game, Paints Warfare. So this assumes you already have a health system. So I'll just show you how to make the UI and this will be as quick as possible. Okay, so let's first make the health bar UI. So I'm assuming you have a canvas and a health system. First, let's disable the health text that you have. Right click, create a new UI image. We'll call this health background. Move it to the bottom left. Let's shift it from the left and from the bottom by five. Make it have the UI sprite. Let's set the width to 200 and the height to 20. Make it a nice transparent black. Duplicate this, parent it, name this health. You can make this red. And the way we'll change this is we'll just change the width like so. So to do this on your health script, at the top, type using Unity Engine the UI, add a new public rect transform health block and a private float original health bar size. Create a new start method and set original health bar size equal to health bar dot size delta dot x. And then one way to set this is in your update method. For example, you can set your health bar dot size delta equal to new vector two original health bar size times the health that you have currently divided by the health that you had originally. So in my case, that's 100. And then do a comma and do a health bar dot size delta dot y, like so. So this updates your health bar to your current health. I would recommend actually not doing it in the update method. So instead, what you could do is copy this and put it just right after you've taken damage in your take damage function, however that is, if possible which is just slightly more optimized. Now in your health script, just drag in your health as a rect transform. Cool, so we have our health bar in the bottom left corner. You can make it bigger if you want or not. Say we take damage and our health bar decreases. Let's actually make our health bar a bit bigger so we can go to our player and selecting the health BG and the health we can make the width 600 and the height 50. And let's see how that looks. I'm a bit big, but we can roll with it. And there you have it, folks. This is how you make a health bar, which is more optimized and, in my opinion, a lot simpler than using a slider. As you can see, it's still basically two lines. Thanks for watching. Enjoy.